Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Doing a little update on my bioactive terrarium for my corn snake, Sunkiss Motley Male. He's down that little hole. In fact, you can actually see his little head and his little eyes looking up at me. But if you're watching this video and you're curious why the terrarium looks a little different, well, you're not wrong. I've planted grass. <laughs> yeah, I planted grass. That's what all this at the bottom of the terrarium is. That is Lagardi's terrarium grass. So I have Lagardi's terrarium grass growing like crazy in here. So, especially for a corn snake, they love as many hiding places and obstacles to climb up and over as possible. That's why this terrarium looks the way it is. He's most likely the most happiest corn snakes because of the terrarium and what I've done to it. You know, I've even gotten these two pieces of dragon wood. This piece here and the one back here going down. I've ordered that from Ligardi. It's dragon wood. It's spiraled wood. I ordered two of those at like 21, 22 inches long. I have a pothos down here, which is, that's the big leaf of the pothos, angel pothos. And then obviously right here is my arrowhead vining like crazy. And you got the arrowheads vine growing along the bottom of the terrarium and then you have the stems and leaves growing off of that and before you know it your terrarium will look like this i even have some arrowhead clippings in a jar of distilled water right now that's starting to root in a strawberry jam bottle or a jar Obviously, you can see that they're starting to root at the bottom in the water. So, so whenever I decide to get a bigger terrarium for my corn snake, and once he gets bigger, I can take those and take a lot of this and put it in a terrarium along with other um, different types of plants. I might even do a Schaeffler tree, like a 21 inch tall Schaeffler tree. Uh. I might do some ferns. Um, obviously, I have plenty of this grass seed. I also have another bag of that. So I have one full bag, and this is left over from this, which that's a lot of terrarium grass. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. 